Turkish narcotics teams uncover tons of heroin destined for Western Europe. Tonight's operation is a major success, but the police here know that while they are busting this ring of drug traffickers, others are getting away with it. A major crackdown is now being implemented in Turkey. Strategically located between Europe and Asia, Turkey sits at a crossroads, making it an attractive route to drug traffickers transporting Afghan heroin to Europe. Sharing its northwest border with Bulgaria, drug traffickers use this route as a launch pad to Europe and beyond. According to the British Foreign Office, as much as 80% of all heroin used in Britain has come through Turkey. Historically, the Balkans has been used as one of the trafficking routes of Afghan heroin into Western Europe. I'd say that roughly 95% of the heroin that's actually used in Europe is sourced in Afghanistan. A lot of that is actually trafficked through the Balkans. It's estimated that multi-ton amounts of heroin are smuggled through Turkey each month. This week alone, over 100 kilograms of heroin has been seized by Turkish police. A major crackdown is underway, and it's obvious as to why this is happening now, say intelligence experts. Uh, yeah, they, uh. It's true that money earned from heroin is mainly used by terrorist organizations. This money is somehow allocated to these groups. External powers that are supporting the PKK can't send money directly to the organization. So instead, they let the PKK control the drug traffic. Revenues from heroin can run into billions of euros. It's widely believed that the outlawed Kurdistan Workers' Party, or PKK, has been using drug profits to fund its armed fight against the Turkish state, a fight that has killed up to 40,000 people so far. Experts say that if Turkey wants to put an end to the PKK, it must therefore tackle drug trafficking head-on. People commit crime, they engage in drug trafficking for one reason, to make money. So you must be effective in pursuing, identifying and seizing the assets of the criminal. And that is why it's so important as well for countries to cooperate in this area. The phenomenon of, of uh, international organized crime transcends several borders and no one country can respond to that threat on its own. So an uphill struggle it seems for Turkey in its fight against drug trafficking. Ankara really needs the support of its European partners, many of which are destination countries, if it is to have any impact on the trade and the money being made by it. Jody Sabral, Press TV, Istanbul.